Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and this is a um, quick reminder that when we have a new version of Windows that is popping up, uh, like in this case we have 25H2 that's starting to roll out, it's not a bad idea to review your security, your privacy settings, check out if nothing has changed. And so um, if you go to the Start menu and to the Settings, you will look at privacy and security. And in here, you will have different options. So the first one we'll look at is uh, the Windows permissions. So here, we'll look at the general tab for now. And so here are five settings that um, you might want to change. This is the first one, the advertising ID. So getting personalized ads. Now that means that if it's on, the algorithms look at you know your browsing and, and what you visit on the web and stuff like that and will actually give you ads in windows because yes sometimes something can pop up as an ad in windows uh, that should be or will try to be relevant to you thanks to what they know about you now if you turn this off it prevents the uh, snooping somewhat of what you do. And that means you'll still have ads, but you'll have ads that are random. They could be relevant, maybe not, because they won't see and won't get the details of you, what you do online, for example. So you can, might want to turn this off if you uh, wish to um, remove a little bit, you know, get, gain a little more privacy, let's say. Let a website show me locally relevant content by accessing my language list. That means that if you have multiple languages, and for example, I have uh, French as one of the language, and I live in a place here in Montreal, Quebec, which is a francophone area, and so it might give me some results of content um, like news items, for example, or um, any other type of content that I might be interested in um, that is related to my area and my, the languages that I speak. So, of course, it's some form of snooping so that it can know what you want. You can say yes or no to this. Let Windows improve start and search results by tracking app launches. So this is snooping by looking at the apps in Windows that you use. And so it will, of course, use that app list to modify and do changes to the start menu that technically could be better for you. Uh, once again, on or off. S show me suggested content and settings app. No. Let's, let's you know, they, they always want you to try things and post things. So you want this to be off, honestly. Um, let's do the minimum of annoyances in Windows. And finally, show me notifications in the setting app. Uh, so you can, of course, turn this off, which means there's no notifications that are going to show up in the settings app. And you'll have just a clean settings app anyways. So uh, whatever you do, you can turn all of them off, uh, all of them, keep them on, whatever. Um, these are some of the little tweaks that you can do in the general tab of the privacy and security. And Windows 11, that's 25H2, but I believe the same settings apply to 24H2 also. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.